guys, welcome back to my channel or welcome to my channel if you're new. Today's video is gonna be a what I eat in a day video. I'm gonna share everything that I eat throughout the day. A lot of this is going to be healthier options with the new year and with just having a baby. I'm really trying to change up my diet a little bit and get healthier and just get more fruits and vegetables and all that good stuff in my body, especially breastfeeding. And being a mom with a toddler, your toddler is gonna eat what you eat. So even just this past week, my husband and I have changed up our diet a lot and we can tell that our son is starting to be more interested and more open to eating the vegetables and the salads and all that that we're eating. Being a mom, I just want my kid to be really healthy and eat healthy stuff. So that's what I have to do as well. But before we jump into the video, I wanted to mention that this video is in collaboration with my friend here on YouTube named Katie. I'm not even gonna try to say her last name because I feel like I'm just gonna totally butcher it. So I will put her name right here on the screen, but I'm also gonna have her channel and her video linked down below in the description box. So you can just look down there and head over to her channel after you finish this video. She is a mom of three and she does very similar content to what I do here on my channel. A lot of vlogs. She recently had a baby, I think two months ago. So she is also on just a healthy postpartum journey like myself. So that's why I'm super excited to be collabing with her. And she is just so sweet and, and it just shows real mom life on her channel and I love that. So I'm sure you guys will love her too. So make sure you head over to her channel after this video. If you're coming from Katie's channel and I'm a mom of two, I have a 21 month old boy and a one month old little girl. And like I said, I just do all kinds of mommy content, very similar to what Katie does. So I would love it if you would subscribe and stick around for the rest of this video. I always start my day off with a hot cup of coffee. And right now I'm using the Target brand Market Pantry Colombian K-Cups. And then I'm using this Caramel Macchiato Creamer. And I do put a little bit of sugar in there as well. For lunch, I'm gonna make a sweet kale salad and I'm gonna be using kale, cabbage, prosciutto, or radishio, however you say that, broccoli, Brussels sprouts, pumpkin seeds and then I'm going to be adding poppy seed dressing on top. So I'm just going to cut everything up, mix it all together in a big bowl and that's going to be my lunch. Sorry about all the background noise because my dishwasher is running right now but my salad is done it looks so so good and then I'm gonna have this body armor drink with it this is the fruit punch these are supposed to be really good for your milk supply so I've been drinking them a lot lately and they also just like taste really good and they're really good for you so I'm gonna have that with my salad the only thing that's not in my salad that I normally would put in there is some dried cranberries or dried blueberries but we don't have any right now so i just did this but it's still gonna be still gonna be delicious okay so i'm still a little bit hungry it's been about like 45 minutes since i actually ate just mom life taking care of kids putting jay down for his nap but i am still a little bit hungry so i made some crackers cheese and 
I put a few of these grape tomatoes on my plate as well. This is the cheese I'm using, the Tillamook Kobe Jack. And then I'm using these townhouse flatbread Italian herb crisp. These are so good. This is like my go-to snack because it's really filling and like it's just so good and it's really not that unhealthy for you in my opinion at least. So yeah, this is one of my favorite snacks. So I'm going to have a little bit of this. Okay, so I'm going to make an iced coffee now. It's about 3.30 so it's been a while since I've ate lunch. Um, I just have some ice here in my cup. I'm using the Starbucks Dark Roast Iced Coffee Mix. And then the Caramel Macchiato International Delight Creamer. This is what I use this morning in my hot coffee. So yeah, I'm gonna put these together in my iced coffee. It is about 5.30 now and I'm gonna start dinner. So tonight we're gonna have a meal that we've never actually made before. We got this idea off of this YouTube channel that we watch, it's called Simnet Nutrition. And he is a vegan and so he shares all kinds of like vegan meals and food and all that kind of stuff. We are not by any means vegan and we will never be vegan, but we do wanna like start incorporating more of that type of stuff into our diet, just healthier options, more vegetables and more fruit. And he always shows good ways to do that. So we're having one of those meals and I'm hoping that it's really good. I feel like you can't really mess it up because it's just like a pasta dinner. So that's what we're gonna be trying tonight and I'm really excited. So I'm gonna be using some Brussels sprouts and these tomatoes as our vegetables. And I might throw some kale in there as well because I feel like that would be really good. And then, like I said, we've never had this before. So this is yellow lentil and brown rice pasta. So I'm hoping it's really good. So this pasta alone has 14 grams of protein, which, which I feel like is a lot for like a pasta. So that's kind of where we're getting our protein from in this dinner tonight. And then I'm just gonna be using this chunky sauteed onion and garlic pasta sauce. So the first thing I'm doing is cutting up all my Brussels sprouts and I'm gonna let those steam first for a little bit just so they get nice and soft. Okay, so while the Brussels sprouts are steaming, I wanted to share what I've been drinking lately. So I've been having this Crystal Light Raspberry Green Tea. It is so good. It's actually pretty sweet, but it's only five calories a serving. So like practically no calories. So like I said, I've been trying to cut out my soda. So this has been great for me. I've gone through like three packs and almost three packs in like a week. But I just put it in this big pitcher and then I just drink it throughout the day and it's so good. After about maybe 10 minutes of my Brussels sprouts steaming, I'm cutting up my tomatoes and kale and I'm, and I'm gonna add that in the pot with the Brussels sprouts and just let all that cook together for a few minutes before I add in the sauce. And at the end, I just added a little bit of Parmesan cheese on top of this, and it was so good. Me and my husband both really liked this meal, and my son ate it as well. This meal was a win. Okay, so the last thing that I'm gonna have tonight is some of this vanilla almond granola. This is the Bare Naked brand. And it's really good, I love it. It's got a little bit of sweetness in it. So it's perfect for like after dinner, 
nighttime snack. But I did want to also share this Omega-3 Trail Mix. This has dried sweetened cranberries, walnuts, pepitas, almonds, and pecans. And this is also one of my favorite things to snack on right now. So these are both like really good healthy options for like nighttime after dinner or during the day. Both pretty healthy and just really good snacks. All right, guys, that's gonna be it for today's What I Eat In A Day video. I hope you enjoyed it. Maybe you got some new ideas of some things to try. Make sure you go and check out Katie's channel. Like I said, I will have her channel and video linked down below in the description box. And don't forget to let her know that I sent you over. Don't forget to subscribe and make sure you give this video a thumbs up and I'll see you guys very soon. Bye.